Let's look at CO2 as an example. If I look through the rules, I notice there are no rules that assign an oxidation number to carbon. So I'm going to label it as X. It's an unknown. I do have a rule for oxygen that says the oxidation number of oxygen will be minus 2. Now, I can actually find the oxidation number of carbon using a small calculation. Remember that the sum of the oxidation numbers of the elements in a neutral compound must equal 0. So we have 1 carbon atom times x plus 2 oxygen atoms times minus 2. Although we report the oxidation number per atom, so each oxygen has an oxidation number of minus 2, when we look at the sum, we need to recognize that we do have two of those oxygen atoms, each with an oxidation number of minus 2. Now, we can say this is equal to 0, so x minus 4 equals 0, and x equals 4. So the oxidation number of carbon in carbon dioxide is plus 4.